a brand new tool called Brain GPT was recently released, and it's actually reading people's minds. Have you ever wanted to control something purely with your mind? Well, by the end of this video, you'll see how mind reading and mind control is actually becoming a real thing and some real world examples of how it will change your entire life. So how is mind reading even possible? That's just something out of science fiction books, right? No, mind reading is a real thing and there's been tons of technological advancements in mind reading over the last few years, especially with the aid of AI. The most recent mind reading breakthrough is from the University of Technology Sydney or UTS. They developed a system that can read participants' minds by simply monitoring the participants' EEG brainwaves, and this is a huge deal. But before we get into why it's such major news, let's first understand what an EEG scan actually is. EEG is a method used to record electrical activity of the brain. It's like listening to the brain's conversations. Our brain cells communicate with each other through electrical signals, and EEG captures these signals using small sensors placed on the scalp. These sensors then pick up the brain's electrical activity, which is recorded and displayed as wavy lines on a computer screen or paper. Imagine your brain is like a busy city with lots of cars moving around. EEG is like a traffic helicopter flying above, watching the flow of cars to see how traffic is moving. This helps doctors understand what's happening in the brain, like checking for problems in the brain's electrical activity or helping to diagnose conditions like epilepsy or sleep disorders. Okay, so great. We now know how EEGs work, but why is mind reading via EEG such a big deal? Because prior attempts to read people's minds were done through fMRI machines, which can cost millions and millions of dollars and are gigantic devices. They fill up entire hospital rooms. EEG scans, on the other hand, can be done with very small and simple devices like a lightweight head cap or hat that can be placed on the patient's head. This is a huge difference compared to the gigantic MRI machines being used for the same thing. Not only that, but prior attempts to read people's minds were done via eye tracking technology as well, which in and of itself can be cumbersome. The most recent EEG tech from the University of Technology in Sydney can be done with EEG alone and not with eye tracking. So how does this groundbreaking mind reading tech actually work? Well, the researchers that created this technology were able to monitor the EEG brainwaves of individuals and send those signals to an AI model called D-Wave or Brain GPT. Think of D-Wave like ChatGPT except for reading minds. D-Wave then translates those EEG brainwave signals to text. In essence, D-Wave, the AI brain GPT model, reads the participant's mind then outputs the text on what that person is thinking onto a computer screen. And this is all done with a small and lightweight head cap. Crazy. Let's see how this works live. So this just shows the EEG scanning the brain right here. And this shows the brain GP system at work. It's analyzing the EEG signals and it's outputting the text of what that person is thinking at the current time. Here's an actual example of brain reading going on live. You can see what the person is thinking in real time. So how accurate is this mind reading brain GPT AI system? It scored a 40% on blue one. Blue one is an independent test to judge how accurate AI models output text is compared to its input. The aim is to get this score to 90%. 90% is important because it's a score that traditional speech recognition programs, ones that listen to audio and convert that audio into text, score on this very test. If the researchers from Sydney can do that, they'll have accomplished the holy grail of mind reading. That is near perfect results of reading someone's mind. So what if accurate mind reading actually happens one day? What does that mean for you and society in general? Let's save the best stuff for last. Here's a not so good implications of the scenario. If mind reading becomes a thing, the loss of privacy will be the first thing to go. Think of the movie, The Minority Report. It's very possible that governments will use mind reading to predict who is going to create a crime based on what they are thinking. Imagine sitting in your couch thinking about how you'd rob a bank just for fun then bam the police bust down your door with a battering ram and put you in jail for a thought crime yes this could happen another negative example is in regards to social media just think if social media can read your mind when you're scrolling facebook instagram or x.com then they'll be able to manipulate you into buying any product they want they'll know your mind's achilles heel and serve you ads that you literally cannot resist you'll buy one of those products advertised to you and the kicker is you won't even know why you'll be completely manipulated without even knowing it. Okay, okay, enough of this depressing and scary crap. Let's move on to how mind reading will make our lives extraordinarily better. First off, paralyzed people and people who've had debilitating strokes will be able to fluently talk with others via brain-to-speech technology, something unheard of 
Europe today. On top of that, paraplegics will be able to control their prosthetics unconsciously and naturally with literally no effort. Furthermore, if this mind reading tech becomes real, you can control almost everything in the physical world with your mind. There would be no need for keyboards or touchscreens anymore. Want to pull up Ozarks on Netflix? Just think about the show and your 80 inch OLED TV will fire up the Netflix app for you and start streaming the latest episode. Want to order Chick-fil-A? Just think about it and DoorDash will read your thoughts and order the food for you. Need a ride to the grocery store? Tesla will read your mind, fire up your Cybertruck, pull it out of the garage and honk the horn to let you know it's ready to take you to the store. Literally anything you can think of could be controlled with your mind. Now these examples are years and years away and even decades away, but they're all examples of how wild our world could change in the not too distant future. And with that, that's it for tonight. If you found this video interesting, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and my free AI email newsletter at fry-ai.com forward slash subscribe. Have a great night. This is Ryan signing out. Take care.